Washington Hebrew Congregation, Washington, D.C. Creator of all the world, thou who has turned dust into creatures of intelligence, how wondrous is thy work, how mysterious thy power which brings order out of chaos. Speaker, I ask my colleagues to join me in welcoming Rabbi Joshua O. Haberman of Washington as our guest chaplain. Rabbi Haberman is a distinguished clergyman from the Washington region, where he served as senior rabbi of the Washington Hebrew Congregation for the past 16 years. Rabbi Haberman was born in Austria, began his studies at the University of Vienna, but was forced to continue his education following the Nazi invasion in the United States at the University of Cincinnati and the Hebrew College in Cincinnati. Today's prayer will be offered by our guest chaplain, Rabbi Joshua O. Haberman of the Washington Hebrew Congregation. <clears throat> o God of all nations, Thou hast put into our minds the vision of an age when nation shall no longer lift up sword against nation, neither shall they learn war anymore. I want to thank Rabbi Joshua Haberman for his willingness to come this week and open our Senate with prayer. He is the rabbi of one of the largest congregations here in Washington, D.C. District, and I'm uh, just very grateful, and I know on behalf of the leadership of both sides that we wish to express our deep gratitude uh, to the rabbi. The prayer will be offered by our guest chaplain today, the Rabbi Joy Hessel from Washington Hebrew Congregation in Washington, D.C. Chaplain. God of all people, we thank you for all that is good in our world. We acknowledge your sovereignty and everlasting presence in our lives. Bless us as we commit ourselves to continuing your work of creation. For our commitment to social justice and peace is our task, and you our guide. Rabbi Hessel is currently serving at the Washington Hebrew Congregation right here in Washington, D.C. as associate rabbi. She has been in that capacity since uh, June of 2001 and is active in many programs, including youth activities and adult education. The rabbi is currently working on an educational article for a book on parenting young adults' uh, children. Thank you, Rabbi Joey Hessel, for your spiritual leadership and for your prayers and for having such wonderful parents who are my constituents. Thank you. Bless those who give service of heart to this great nation. Give them strength to temper their judgments by the compassion of the human soul. Know that none are free until all are free, free from fear, want, bigotry, and callous hatred of the other. Let the courage of their convictions make America worthy of her past and blessed by her future. In delivering today's opening prayer in the house, Rabbi Lustig continues a venerable and important tradition. Since the Washington Hebrew Congregation was created in 1862, every single one of its senior rabbis has delivered an opening prayer before the U.S. Congress. Rabbi Lustig now joins that esteemed group. 